Okay, so we're just in your uh, uh, exterior toilet here, and down the bottom there, so mostly not shedding. So an active termite, and as I showed you just on the other side here, we've got some in the beading. Now, again, inactive termite indicators, it does show that there's been a history, and this is the most vulnerable part of the property because it's slab on ground and the timbers go into the bottom. So you've also got some just along here on your plate that used to go down all this mud and that plate is consistent with microceratermes um, and I want to show you also the uh, the windows so just the panes that move because there's no putty uh, not anneal glass and um, the frames coming apart in some areas so I've met immediate rectification for safety reasons um, just to make sure that that uh, minimizes any risk there and the stairs to the property both the front and the back um, deteriorated uh, caution needed for again for the safety factors uh, more information in the report and um, just uh, the framing for the uh, rear patio too is uh, deteriorated and in some areas detaching although um, yeah, some strengthening could be done to uh, make it stronger um, but it's consistent with it's what you see is what you get really same with the carport that would be non-compliant overspanned but uh, usable, but um, some strengthening should be done to bring it up to today's standard.